Hi there. Today's video we will consider uh, derivatives of log functions. Now, because of the uh, fact that I can, we can change any log function into natural log, we really only will consider the derivative of natural log functions. Remember your uh, formula from algebra class? I will remind you actually. Um, the log base b of x is equal to the natural log of x divided by the natural log of b, the change of base formula. And so, and since natural log of b is just a number, we really can just deal with natural log. Basic derivative of a log function, natural log y equals ln of x, the derivative y prime is 1 over x. Of course, we generally don't have just plain old x. We generally have to use um, other, you know, chain rule or other derivative rules. If I have y equals the natural log of x cosine of x, then my derivative, this is a composition, my derivative would be derivative of the outside function, 1 over x cosine of x times derivative of the inside product first times the derivative of the second. Make sure you put in parentheses around that, otherwise it looks like minus plus the second times the derivative of the first. And if I did want to simplify it, I can leave it like that. Notice there is another way of doing this same value. I will end up actually simplifying this in a second, but I could use rules of logarithms. Remember your rules of logarithms y equals the natural log of x cosine of x is the same as the natural log of x plus the natural log of cosine of x. All right, natural log of a times b is the natural log of a plus the natural log of b. And so now my derivative is 1 over x plus 1 over cosine of x times the negative of sine of x, or 1 over x minus tangent of x. And notice if I had distributed this through up here, I would have gotten x negative sine x over x cosine of x is negative tangent of x. And this, when I distribute the other one, the cosines, Cosine of x is reduced, and I'm left with plus 1 over x. We get exactly the same thing. Either way. Suppose I have... This is problem 1D in the worked out solutions. y equals the secant of x plus the natural log of arc cosine of x. I like to bring in these previous functions that you've seen to try and remind you of derivatives and rules that we've had. This is again a composition. In this case, the, uh, ec this whole part, then the brackets is inside the secant. And so the derivative of secant of something is secant of that thing. We repeat this exactly. Tangent of that thing. Oops. Times the derivative of that thing. And on the inside here, I have a sum. So I take the derivative of each piece separately. One plus. Now I have a composition again. The derivative of the natural log of arc cosine would be 1 over arc cosine of x. Remember that is not, arc cosine is not the same as 1 over cosine. Um, times the derivative of arc cosine, which was, if you remember, let me do it this way, negative 1 over the square root of 1 minus x squared. And so I'm going to leave it like this. I'm not even going to bother trying to simplify it. It is a mess. But that is the derivative that we get. One last problem. 
an application. I want to find an equation of the normal line. Two y equals the natural log of x squared plus 2x plus 7 at x equal 1. So to get the equation of the normal line, I need the derivative. y prime is, again, the derivative of the natural log would be 1 over times the derivative of the inside x plus 2, or I could have just written 2x plus 2 over x squared plus 2x plus 7. And I need the point, the y value at 1 would be the natural log of 1 plus 2 plus 7 is the natural log of 10. I'm just going to leave it like that. That is the exact value. The derivative at 1 would be 4 over 10 or 2 fifths. This represents the slope of the tangent line. To get the slope of the normal line, I have to take the negative reciprocal. It is perpendicular to the tangent line. So negative 5 halves is the slope of the normal line, which means the equation of the normal line becomes y minus uh, natural log of 10, my y value, is equal to my slope, negative 5 halves times x minus 1.